I'm Fritz Nelson here at CES 2012. Healthcare gadgets are a big thing. I'm with Jeff Holov, who is the CEO of a company called Basis. Now you guys have this uh, really nice looking watch. Uh, we do, it's actually uh, a wearable set of sensors. Inside of here there are five different sensors measuring things about my wellness all the time throughout the course of my regular every day. Not just when I go to the doctor, not just when I go on a run and I'm willing to wear a chest strap, but all day long. We track a number of things, but the big breakthrough is being able to track your heart rate continuously. Um, and our belief is that the heart is a core indicator of your overall wellness. We can understand all kinds of things about how well you are and how well you're getting by measuring heart rate, but we don't have to wear a chest strap to do that. Okay, so let's talk about the four different areas that you measure. Number one? Number one is heart rate. That's the fundamental one. On top of that, we use accelerometers to measure motion, to measure how active you are. In addition to that, we add something called galvanic skin response, or GSR. And that measures perspiration. That helps us tell us how intense the activity that you've just been engaged in is. A light activity doesn't result in a lot of perspiration, a lot of heavy activity does. And then the last thing is temperature. Uh, but being able to measure both your skin temperature as well as the ambient temperature, your room temperature. So by putting all of those things together, we can get really interesting insights about how well you're living. So what happens once all that, the data is collected continuously and fed where? That's right, the idea is that the device based on form factor, based on being small and light, is something you can actually wear all day long if you want to. The more you wear it, the more insightful we can be for you, obviously. We get all the data in the device, we upload it to a cloud service, and then we analyze it. We run a bunch of fancy algorithms on it to try to figure out what does this data mean, and then how do we translate that to you in just kind of everyday common language that, that everyone can understand. Before we get to the data, how does it get from the watch to the cloud? Is it is there some kind of wireless communication or I gotta plug it in somewhere? The, the device will ship with Bluetooth in it, but it also is something that you can just simply plug in. It'll charge and upload all at the same time without having to configure anything. Okay, so that's a one-time thing whenever you think to do it. Yeah, that's right. I can tell you for me, what I do is when I come into the office in the morning, I plug in for 10 minutes, upload my data, recharge, and then I can look at how yesterday went for me. How long can you go without uploading the data? Uh, you, can, uh, you can go for uh, more than a week without having to charge or upload the data. Okay, so talk about some of the data, uh, how, how, it, how it looks to the end user. Yeah, well I think it's important to understand that we're trying to have several sensors cooperating together and then trying to pull out data where all of these sensors are adding to the insights for each other, right? So. Um, uh, an accelerometer might register activity or we might be able to see your heart rate climb but your heart rate rising doesn't necessarily mean exercise but if your heart rate is rising and we're detecting perspiration and the accelerometer is going crazy well that probably means exercise so that's the kind of analysis that we can do to try to figure out what's going on for your health and wellness we then show you all of that with a, a kind of web-based dashboard okay and what's in that dashboard we're looking at it now well, the first thing that we do is we translate all this fancy data into these everyday metrics that I was just understanding, starting with calories, how many calories am I burning versus how many I should be burning, steps, right, am I getting to my 10,000 steps per day that's a, that's a day that's well lived, how well am I sleeping. So I can see all of those in the context of what I should be doing. Underneath that, I can see how my heart rate changes in the day. And we're not ex expecting everyone necessarily to know what your heart rate is at every given moment, but we can use that heart rate to tell you interesting things about your health. Now, some of this data might be useful for my doctor if I'm, you know, maybe I have some heart issues. Is there a way, other than just sharing my, this is a browser-based uh, product, sharing the link? Yeah, so what we're, we're trying to do is take all of this data and turn it into really the insights, not the raw data. But you will have the ability to export that raw data and share it with your physician or your personal trainer or whoever it is in your life that can extract meaning out of that data and tell you what to do with it. Great. And the cost of this? $199. Thank you so much. You bet. My pleasure.